morning viewer bien das yaar as a breaking news from ukraine ukraine has began using long range ballistic missiles secretly provided by the us against invading russian forces american officials have confirmed the weapons were part of 300 M8 package approved by US President Joe Biden in March and they arrived this month. They have already been used at least once to strike Russian targets in occupied Crimea, US media reported. Mr. Biden has now signed a new 61 billion dollar packages of aid for Ukraine. The US previously supplied Ukraine with a mid-range version of the army tactical missile systems but had been reluctant to send anything more powerful partly over concerns about compromising us military readiness however mr biden is said to have secretly given the green light to send the long range system which can fire missiles distances of up to 300 km in february i can confirm that the united states provided ukraine with long range attack systems at the president's direct direction state department spokesman Bedan Patel said the US did not announce these at the onset in order to maintain operational security for Ukraine at their request he added it is not clear how many of the weapons have already been sent but US national security advisor Jack Sullivan said Washington planned to send more they will make a difference but i have said before at this podium there is no silver bullet he said the longer range missiles were used for the first time last week to strike a russian airfield in occupied crimea writers views agencies quoted an unnamed us official as saying and the new missiles were also used in an attack on russian troops in the occupied port city of bendraks overnight on tuesday according to the new york times recent months have seen kyiv step up its calls for western assistance as its stocks of ammunition are depleted and russia makes steady gains the new aid packages follows month of grit lock amid opposition to the aid from some in congress it is going to make america safer it is going to make the world safer mr biden said after signing it into law reacting to the package ukrainian president Vladimir Zelensky said now we will do everything to make up for half a year spent in debates and doubts what the russian occupier was able to do during this time what putin is now planning we must turn against him mr zelensky recently warned that a russian offensive was expected in the coming weeks after ukraine's loss of the city of abdivka during the winter ukrainian forces have suffered from a shortage of ammunition and air defense systems in recent month and officials have blamed delays in military aid from the us and other western allies for the loss of lives and territory mr sullivan said on wednesday it was certainly possible that russia could make additional tactical gains in the coming weeks since russia invaded ukraine on 24 february 2022 10 of thousands of people most of them soldiers have been killed or injured on both sides and millions of people have fled their homes bien das exclusive report